Okay, this is our lab safety quiz. I'm going to go ahead and read each of these questions. If you do not need these questions read aloud, then go ahead and continue to read and take the test on your own. But this is for students who do need to hear this out loud. We're going to read each scenario, and then I want you to enter into your clicker the correct lab rule that is being broken in this scenario. There should only be one broken rule per scenario. Okay, so there should only be one broken rule per scenario. And you're going to want to enter that number into your clicker and then hit the send button. Number one, Mackenzie was so thirsty after PE class, she decided to sneak a drink out of the science room sink while Mrs. Williard was helping another student. Which rule is this violating? A, keep your hands away from your face, nose, and or mouth. B, wear safety glasses or goggles when instructed. C, never eat, drink, chew gum, or taste anything in the science room. Or D, dress properly. Number two. Tiara was enjoying a great book and couldn't put it down while Mrs. Williard was explaining the instructions to the lab. She decided that she would just ask Lily what she needed to do. Which rule is this violating? A. Treat all preserved specimens with care. B. Keep your work area clean. C. Perform only authorized experiments. D. Follow all written and verbal instructions carefully. Ask Mrs. Williard if you do not understand any of the given directions. Which rule is this violating? Number three. Hunter wanted to be helpful and grabbed a microscope in each hand to carry it back to his table. Mrs. Williard look at him, looked at him with a frown. Why was she so angry if Hunter was trying to be helpful? Which rule is it violating? A. Keep your work area clean. B. Always carry a microscope with both hands. C. Use extreme caution when using matches or a burner. Or D. Follow all written and verbal instructions carefully. Number four. Katie loves her sequin flip-flops. She decided she would wear them on lab day because fashion is her number one priority. Which rule is this violating? A. Dress properly. B. Keep your hands away from your face, nose, and mouth. C. Perform only authorized or approved experiments. Or D. Wear safety goggles or glasses when instructed. Number five. Reed was in a hurry to catch the bus. He wanted to grab his things and go. In the process, he forgot to wash his hands after a lab. Sabby followed him down the stairs and picked up all kinds of chemicals on his hands. Which rule is this violating? A. Be responsible. No horseplay, practical jokes, or pranks permitted. B. Wash your hands with soap and water frequently and before leaving the science room. C, dress properly, or D, keep your work area clean. Number six, Carter loves being prepared for class. However, he had his trapper keeper, science book, and science binder all back in the lab station. Brenda accidentally bumped into the trapper keeper, and a graduated cylinder of liquid spilled everywhere. Which rule is this violating? A, Keep your work area clean. Bring only your lab sheet and pencil to the lab area. B, wear goggles or safety glasses when instructed. C, treat all preserved specimens and dissecting supplies with care and respect. Or D, perform only authorized experiments. Number seven. Bo had been thinking of a cool experiment all weekend. 
On Monday, while Mrs. Lawyer was at lunch, he decided he would conduct his experiment in his free time. Which rule is this violating? A. Report any accident to Mrs. Williard. B. Always carry a microscope with both hands. C. Perform only authorized experiments. Or D. Dress properly. Number 8. Alex was busy working on her, on her lab, but her nose itched. She couldn't help us scratch her nose with her gloved hand before she went back to work. Which rule is this violating? A. Dress properly. B. Wash your hands with soap and water frequently. C. Be responsible. No horseplay, practical jokes, or pranks. Or D. Keep your hands away from your nose, mouth, and eyes. Number 9. Troy and Austin decided to wrestle in the middle of class. They bumped into a table and knocked over a beaker. The beaker smashed to the floor into tiny pieces. Which rule is this violating? A. Follow all written and verbal directions carefully. B. Be responsible. No horseplay, practical jokes, or pranks. C. Consider all chemicals to be dangerous. Or D. Handle all glassware with care. Never pick up hot or broken glassware with your bare hands. Number 10. Joey wanted to pick up the mess created by Troy and Austin, so he started picking up all the broken glassware on the floor with his bare hands. Which rule is this violating? A. Be responsible. No horseplay, practical jokes, or pranks. B. Wear safety glasses or goggles when instructed. C. Handle all glassware with care. Never pick up hot or broken glassware with your bare hands. Or D. Learn where the safety equipment is and how to use it. This completes the lab safety quiz. If you need to hear another question repeated, please go ahead and rewind this movie so you may find the question that you need to hear again. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Williard and she will assist you.